Hey, how's it guys? In this video, I'm going to show you how to drag a tab into a separate window in VS Code. Alright, so this is one of the most requested features in VS Code, which is being able to drag a tab into a separate window. And unfortunately, Microsoft has an implement such feature in VS Code. And I was able to uh, figure out a workaround how we can uh, use a separate window to modify the same file. All right, so here I have a script called lesson.py. And the first thing I want to do is I want to open the uh, command palette using the shortcut Control shift p Then I want to search for open active file in new window. And choose the option. And that will launch the same file in a separate window. And at this point, these two windows are going to be treated as two separate uh, instances or processes. And what you want to do here is you want to open the setting window or the setting file. So here I'm going to uh, search for open settings, and which is going to be in JSON format. Now in the settings, we want to change the uh, configuration, how we want to auto save the file. In my settings, I'm setting my uh, auto save setting to a uh, window change. What that means is every time uh, when your window focus uh, is out of focus, so for example, uh, if I type something uh, in my editor, so this is a common. Now if I select something else, here let me select something outside the uh, editor. Now going back to my first window, the comment is not added because we're actually saving the file when the focus is lost. And there are a couple options we can choose actually. So we have four different options. After delay, which means uh, after how much time passed, the editor is going to uh, save the file. Or we can turn that off. Or we can change the setting to unforgis change or unwindow change. Uh, I usually use uh, unforgis change, which means when the focus is on something else, the file will get out saved. So here let's say if I want to add another comment, this is comment two. Now if I slap back to the second window, uh, the second comment is going to get added. All right, so this is going to be everything I'm going to share in this video, and hopefully you guys found this video useful. And as always, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.